there's nothing wrong with Dance of the Weed, and there are actually some good bits of animation and good bits of music, but personally, I didn't really enjoy it. This is a 1941 MGM cartoon directed by Rudolf Ising and James and Brewer, and it's about this little weed, and um, if he's... We spend quite a bit of time getting to know this weed and we kind of get to know his personality and what he's feeling. And I have to say the design of him is, is, is kind of nice. I kind of like the animation style with this. And there is a, a beautiful little ballerina that he very much has eyes for and wants to dance with. And the question is, will they have a blossoming relationship by the end of it or not? And it's definitely a very... Um, roller coaster journey of emotions it's sometimes delicate sometimes ferocious there are all kinds of almost natural elements happening and and it's a very it's got an almost silly symphony kind of vibe to it which works quite well and it's very well animated the music and the sound effects are brilliant the music definitely helps to carry the mood of of the um cartoon a lot more than most mgm cartoon music does and the characters were, were quite likeable. There is absolutely nothing wrong with it. And as I said, the actual animation quality, the style of the animation is often very soft and gentle. Sometimes it's quite striking. It definitely fits with whatever mood that particular moment has. And it's fine. It's, it's, it's actually a very good cartoon. Why did I not like it? Well, I, I don't know. It's just not my kind of animation. It's not my kind of cartoon. Um... I'm not the biggest fan of some of the Disney Silly Symphonies, and as I said, it kind of feels very similar in certain aspects. So I, I, I feel like I'm contradicting myself, saying it's beautifully animated, great music, nice characters, and I didn't like it. And that seems like it shouldn't make sense, but I guess what I mean is I didn't mind watching it, and there are all these positives, but I probably won't ever watch it again. Having said that, I do recommend it. Dance of the Weed is very beautifully done if it's your kind of narrative or your kind of characters. I guess I'm able to appreciate it without having to personally like it. Um, kind of in the way that one would appreciate the Mona Lisa, but if there was no historic value to it, I definitely wouldn't buy that as a print. Um, I know it's a very weird, weird comparison to make, but hopefully you know what I mean. Dance of the Weed is, for all things considered, a good animation. It's just not personally to my taste.